That is enough. I tire of you. I'm about to declare dumb ways to die. Oh, sorry. You say something that's a really catchy tune on TikTok. I was saying, America, I am about to declare. Are you sure about that? You realize that's like Uncle Rico picking a fight with Goku, right? At least have enough common decency to let him finish what he was trying to say. All right, all right. I'll play nice. Go ahead, Sen. America, I am about to declare a state of emergency. Oh, no, how about another draft? <laughs> Fine. Okay, go ahead. It's going to be stupid. I am declaring war. Told you it was stupid. I'll be honest. I kind of saw this one coming, but can we talk about this and not act too rash? The war's over. He ain't going to answer. He lost. It's been like five seconds. What the bloody hell happened? I don't know how much clearer I have to be. He won the coin toss and elected to receive. And by receive, I mean a pallet of nuclear weapons. I call it Rapid Dragon. Who the fuck measures nuclear weapons in pallet? Do you see that up there in the night sky? Oh, please tell me you're not going to start reciting scripture. No, I was just going to point out whose flag isn't on that moon up there. Wait, didn't he also have nuclear weapons? Yeah, left over from the 1950s. 70% of them didn't launch. We knew where all the rest of the launchers were, so about five of them got off the ground after the rest of them exploded on the pad. And of those five, you're telling me those five are going to get through SBX, GMD, THAAD, Aegis, Patriot, Shorad, and LPWS? Come on. Let me just send some giant exoatmospheric school buses at you and see how hard they are to shoot down. How exactly could you do that immediately and not take out the Taliban in 20 years? Turns out it's really easy to take out the bad guys when they wave their flag, wear their own uniforms, don't hide behind women and children, and I don't have to walk aimlessly through the desert for 20 years saying, are you the enemy? And when they say yes, shoot them. 